Last week, we doubled the Ronster's power with this insane motor upgrade. Today, we're unlocking its full power. But first, would you rather have $10,000 in cash or a 70 mile per hour electric go-kart? My giveaway is ending in two weeks in the winner picks between the cash and the cart. Comment below what you would pick, I'm curious. The truck is in autopilot. It's taking me to downtown Los Angeles where LA eBikes is installing my ASI BAC 8000. This is the key to unlocking the Ronster's full power. This autopilot update on the Ford Ranger is crazy. It's taking me all the way downtown. No hands, no hands. <laughs> Oh no, no, last time I was here, it was perfectly new. No, it's so sad. The TRPs are hella nice. That's a, that's a clean looking bike. It looks like a praying mantis. Yes. This one looks like a doofy. Do you know what happened? No, I don't. We don't really ask questions. <laughs> there we go. So that's the 4,000 I've been running. And this is the 8,000, it's bigger brother that we're about to throw on. This is about a 50% increase in uh, phase amps. It really just comes down to what the battery can do then, right? Bikes has successfully installed the BAC 8000 on the Ronster custom mounting bracket looks so good and it should be ready to rip let's give it a throttle here we're downtown here's what the Ronster is looking like we've got the upgraded Socian motor 72 volt tri battery discount code Sir Ronster and the BAC 8000 I've got 17 inch warp 9 wheels EXT front fork EXT rear shock. This is the best the Ronster's ever looked. The weakest link by far are the McGurr MT5 brakes. Running this much power, I need to upgrade these brakes. I'm just gonna give it a couple pulls here before we hit the streets. Butter, butter off the line. <laughs> oh. oh my God. Whoa, I couldn't even stop. <laughs> Look at that skid just to slow down. This thing's a beast. All right, let's do a speed run, all right? What's the plan if we get lit up? Um, we'll stay together so they get upset, and then I'll pull off, they'll pull, they'll get me, and you keep going. Yeah. Wow. So the biggest power upgrade was done in the last video is the motor upgrade. This is the controller. So now we're pushing the maximum amount of power possible that the battery can do. It is, it is juicy. We're doing a raw ride through LA right now. I'm gonna try to make as few cuts as possible. You just barely have to tap the throttle to get a ton of speed on this. Red light, red light.
touch the throttle. Oh my god. Oh, something crazy is going on up ahead. A lot of lights. Let's check it out. It is currently 7 a.m. downtown LA. Wow, look at that just pops up with just a throttle. That's so powerful. Oh my god. I need to upgrade the brakes. That's next. I hope my speed is up here in the corner. It should be, should be showing live action speed. Oh, it's so powerful. It's so controlled though. Like I don't feel, I'm not scared of it even though it's double the power I've been riding, which is already a lot. <laughs> It's just a power wheeling machine. One of the real problems with a bike like this is that you need friends with bikes that are just as fast or else you just end up waiting for them to catch up. Caesar's on a 72 volt VAC 4000 Suron, which is exactly what I've been running. And you know what? If I really wanted to, I don't, I don't think he could keep up. Just power wise, not skill wise. He's a really good rider. And he did a banging job upgrading my bike. Motor and controller. LA e-bikes. Uh, there's not many oppor opportuni opportunities. I'm so, there's so much going on. Not many options in LA for uh, working on your Suron or upgrading it. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, it's just, God, it's so fun. It's so fun. <laughs> After riding the Suron for like three years now, every, every year basically, I need, I need a power upgrade because you get used to it, you acclimate. And this is exactly what I needed, dude. I'm full throttle, you fucking really. <laughs> it's so crazy, dude. The upgraded motor, literally you can push it full throttle for as long as you want. And it's just room temperature. Not too many cars. We never ride this early. It's literally 7 a.m. Wow. Made it out, baby. Let's go. This is the only thing I'll wake up at 7 a.m. for. Oh, this man knows what's up. That's sick. It's, it's, how do I say this? It's just exactly how much power you'd expect when you hit the throttle. That's exactly what I thought about it when I had his setup, this BSC 4000 stock motor. Plenty of power, it's exactly what you'd expect it to be. But once you get used to it, this is the step up for sure. I really don't know how much further up you should go from this. Look at that, how it just lifts the wheel.
<laughs> oh man, it's hard to be on your best behavior on a bike like this. Every video I'm trying to improve, right? I want every video to be better than the last. And I'm not sure, I'm not sure what you want to see. I personally, whoa, my man's driving it backwards. I personally like cutting up the video a lot, but you know what? I think, I think the longer shots just riding is also really fun. So that's what this video is going to be a little more long shots. We got a cop up ahead dealing with someone else, I think. Yeah, they got their hands full. <laughs> I don't care what that number was. That's fucking fun. Oh shit. Interstate 5. <laughs> Fuck. I don't think I've ever gone on the highway besides one of those group rides in San Diego for just a quick second. Oh. Breaking the laws of nature right now. <laughs> Let's go. This is fun. This is fun. It's also the not the best idea. I don't want to lose my man. Let's go. Slowing down up here. Oh, there's a cop, cop, cop. <laughs> this guy knows what's up. We'll let him clear the way for us. Yeah, tell him what's up. Tell him to move. It's awesome. I think my rear brake's going out a little bit. Probably shouldn't be wheeling on the highway like this. <laughs> wow. Not many e-bikes make it onto this road. But it, calling this an e-bike might really be a stretch. This is uh, very much motorcycle territory. Hey, right, ready? <laughs> Not even close. Not even close. Oh, 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 about to run through the red. Right now we play the waiting game. This is what I was talking about before when you have a really fast bike. 
people can't keep up. <laughs> One hour later. <laughs> Dude, that wasn't even close. That just shows how big of an up, because this is the setup I was running. Yeah. BAC, it's actually my same BAC 4000 controller, stock motor, 72 volt battery. It's just not even close. Not even so this is a totally, totally upgraded bike. Super nice. I've been doing so many burnouts on this tire that the left is lower than the right, so I need to do a burnout on the right. There we go. I'm about to fulfill a lifelong fantasy, a lifelong dream. I think is commonly shared amongst riders. It's a once in a lifetime chance. Let's go. Whoa, yes, that was sick. Let's go. That was awesome. Next week, you and I are flying to Utah. We got invited to drive this. That is next week's video. And the week after, my giveaway is ending. You choose between $10,000 in cash or the 70 mile per hour electric go-kart. There's only two weeks left to enter, so I've linked it all down below. Shout out to LA eBikes for upgrading my Suron in this video. And as always, thank you so much much for watching. As I do. Yeah.